What is the value of the expression 9 plus 6 divided by 2 multiplied by 6 over 2? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? This expression confused a lot of people and made them choose the wrong option. Let's dive in and break it down a step by step together. And the first step to solve this question, many people go straight to the expression 9 plus 6 in the numerator of this fraction and replace the whole expression with 15 divided by 2 times 6 over 2. And the next step, they move on to the division between 15 and 2 and simplifying this expression to 7.5 multiplied by 6 over 2. Then, they say the 2 in the denominator and the 6 in the numerator of this fraction can be simplified and the final answer will be 22.5. And without any hesitation, they quickly say that option D is the correct answer to this question. However, this answer is absolutely wrong. Alright, now let me walk you through a surprise of how to solve this expression properly. To solve this question, we must strictly follow the steps outlined by the PEMDAS row. It means that we need to carry out all the operations from top to bottom in order. Alright, as you can see on the screen, in the numerator of this fraction, first we have an addition sign, then a division sign, and finally a multiplication. According to the PEMDAS row, we must perform multiplication and division first, because they have a higher priority than addition. However, it's very important to remember that multiplication and division are at the same level of precedence. In this case, the best thing to do is to start from the left side of the expression and carry out the multiplication and division step by step. So, first we go for the division between 6 and 2, and we can write the whole expression as 9 plus 3 times 6 over 2. And the next step, it's time for the multiplication between 3 and 6, which simplifies this expression to 9 plus 18 over 2. Finally, we handle the addition in the numerator and simplify this expression to 27 over 2, which ultimately gives us the answer 13.5. That's great. Option C is the correct answer to this question. Alright, now let's solve another tricky math question together. What is the value of the expression 55 divided by 5 multiplied by open parentheses 8 plus 3 close parentheses and again multiplied by 2? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? Let's go through this question and step by step and solve it together. Many people when trying to solve this question first go for the expression inside the parentheses because they believe parentheses have a higher priority than the other operations. So, they simplified this expression to 55 divided by 5 times 11, then multiplied by 2. And the next step, they go for the two multiplication signs that I've highlighted in yellow, because they think multiplication has a higher priority than division. So, instead of this expression, they write 55 divided by 110, which finally gives them the answer 0.5. And immediately, they conclude that the correct answer to this question is option A. But, I have to say, we were tricked and it's not the correct answer to this question. Alright, now let me explain a step by step how to solve this expression properly. To solve this question, we must follow a rule that is called PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows us the priority of the order of operations. Okay, and the first step, we go for the expression inside the parentheses because it has the highest priority among all the operations. So, Instead of this expression, we can write 55 divided by 5 times 11 and multiply by 2. Alright, as you can see on the screen, in this expression, we have one division sign followed by two multiplication signs. We must pay close attention that multiplication and division have exactly the same level of priority in the PEMDAS row. In this situation, the best thing to do is to start from the left and perform these two operations in order. So, first we perform the division between 55 and 5, which simplifies this expression to 11, multiplied by 11, and again multiplied by 2. And the final step, we perform the multiplication between 11 and 11, and instead of this expression, we can write 121 times 2, which finally gives us the answer 242.